So I don't know how long I'm going to have to do this. I haven't done a video in over a week because I've been in the hospital. But I get to leave tomorrow. Um, I want to show you what I had done. I had to have a tunnel cap put in. That is because last Friday, I thought it was my blood pressure is dropping because they drop a lot. But I uh, blacked out and fell and I landed on my arm that has my fistula in it. And I got it seven and a half years. It decided to die. It said I'm retiring. So I wound up in the hospital because I fell and blacked out. And the ambulance obviously had to come and get me. I didn't have enough strength to get up. I got to the hospital and I had over a liter of fluid around my heart that the specialist had to syringe out, which was causing my liver to go into cirrhosis. I was, uh, I was going into septus is what it was. I was dying like it was miserable. I was in CCU for three days and then they, they moved me over into the step down floor. I get to go home tomorrow because I got this catheter. I get my dialysis treatment and then I get to finally see my Frankie who I have not gotten to see in over a week. My little chihuahua baby. I know he's going through anxiety. Um, sorry I look so horrible. My mouth is my face. My everything is more of a wreck than normal. Can't wait to get home and actually do my makeup and actually brush my hair. <laughs> um, but that's what's been going on. Uh, for fellow dialysis warriors, you guys know this is no joke. No joke at all. I was doing good for eight years. I plan on doing good for another eight. It's just a little rough um, right now. I don't know why everything hit at once. But that's what's going on. That's why I never made a video for a couple weeks. Um, nothing really funny to say. The staff here is amazing. That's that's awesome. The doctors here were amazing. I'm just going to go home tomorrow and recoup the rest of the way. Monday start back at my dialysis center. And when they figure out how they want to do this fistula or graft, then... I think they said it'll take a total of 12 weeks, which actually is half the time it took the first time around. It took six months the first time around. He's saying it's only going to take three this time, so that's good. That's a bonus, right? Um, but I wanted to thank you guys for being so supportive, listening to my ramblings when I do it. I had such a panic attack last night. Nothing was helping. I was... I was finally able to um, take the pain pill for my back last night. My blood pressures were still low, but that's my norm. Um, I am doing better, though. But I wanted to hop on here real quick. It's like a really short video. I don't think it's going to hit five minutes. And I apologize for that. But when I get back at home, get back on my life, I'll talk about my life some more. I just didn't really want to... Um, go into the past too much here at the hospital, but I thought I'd just keep you current on this one. Um, I hope everyone's doing well. I hope everyone enjoyed their holiday. I hope everyone brought in the new year the right way. Apparently, I brought it in an interesting way. <laughs> um, you guys are amazing as always. If you have comments, leave them. If you have questions, ask them. I always answer. I really do appreciate the support and just thank you from this bipolar woman to the world. Thank you.